Spelliformia is a suborder within the order Carnivora consisting of cat-like carnivorans, including cats, hyenas, mongooses, civets, and related taxa. Feliformia stands in contrast to the other suborder of Carnivora, Caniformia. Both suborders share one characteristic which distinguishes Carnivora from all other mammals, the possession of the four carnassial teeth. The separation of Carnivora into the broad groups of Feliformes and Caniformes is widely accepted, as is the definition of Feliformia and Caniformia as suborders. The classification of filiforms as part of the Feliformia suborder or under separate groupings continues to evolve. Systematic classifications dealing with only extant taxa, 1, 2, include all filiforms into the Feliformia suborder, though variations exist in the definition and grouping of families and genera. The extant families as reflected in the taxa chart at right and the discussions in this article reflect the most contemporary and well supported views. Molecular phylogenies show the Feliformia to be monophyletic. 8. Systematic classifications dealing with both extant and extinct taxa vary more widely. Some, 4, separate the Feliformes as Aleroidae and Feliformia. Others, 3, include all Feliformes into the Feliformia suborder. Recent studies suggest this inclusion of possible ancestors into Feliformia may be spurious. 5. The extinct families as reflected in the taxa chart at right are the least problematic in terms of their relationship with extant filiforms. Characteristics All extant filiforms share a common attribute, their auditory bully. This is a key diagnostic in classifying species as filiform versus caniform. In filiforms the auditory bully are double-chambered, composed of two bones joined by a septum. Caniforms have single-chambered or partially divided auditory bully, composed of a single bone. This feature, however, is problematic for the classification of the extinct Nymravidae as filiforms. Nymravid fossils show ossified bully with no septum, or no trace at all of the entire bulla. It is assumed they had a cartilaginous housing of the ear mechanism. The specific characteristics of extant filiform bully suggest a common ancestor, though one has not been identified in the fossil records. There are other characteristics that differentiate filiforms from caniforms and probably existed in their stem taxa. But due to speciation these do not apply unambiguously to all extant species. Filiforms tend to have shorter rostrums than caniforms, fewer teeth, and more specialized carnitials. Filiforms tend to be more carnivorous and are generally ambush hunters. Caniforms tend more toward omnivorous and opportunity-based feeders. Many filiforms have retrochtal or semi-retrochtal claws and many are arboreal or semi-arboreal. Filiforms also tend to be more digitigrade. In contrast, most caniforms are terrestrial, have non-retrochtal claws and tend to be plantigrade. Extant families, there are seven extant families, 12 subfamilies, 56 genera and 114 species in the Feliformia suborder. They range natively across all continents except Australia and Antarctica. Most species are arboreal or semi-arboreal ambush hunters. Target prey varies based on the species size and available food sources. An overview of each family is provided here. For detailed taxa and descriptions of the species in each family, follow the links to other articles and external references. Family Eupluridae includes Fossa, Vale Nuke, Malagasy Civet, and Malagasy Mongooses, all of which are restricted to the island of Madagascar. There are eight species in the family, though variations in form are significant. These differences initially led to the species in this family sharing common names with, and being placed in the different families of, apparently more similar species on the mainland. However phylogenetic analysis of DNA provides strong evidence that all Malagasy carnivorans evolved from a single common ancestor that was a herpestid. 6a, 6b, recent phylogenetic analysis supports this view and places all of the Malagasy carnivorans in the family Eupluridae. 7. The differences in form make it difficult to concisely summarize the species in this family. The range in size is as diverse as the range in form with smaller species at less than 500 g and the largest species at up to 12 kg. Some have retrochtal or semi-retrochtal claws and others do not. 
they all tend to have slender bodies and pointed rostra. Diet varies with size and form of the species and, like their mainland counterparts, ranges from small mammals, insects and invertebrates through to crustaceans and mollusks. Family Felidae are the best known of cat-like carnivorans. There are 41 extant species, and all but a few have retractile claws. This family is represented on all continents except Australia and the Antarctic. The species vary in size from the tiny black-footed cat at only 2 kg to the tiger at 3 or kg. Diet ranges from large to small mammals, birds and insects. Family Anidae has four extant species and two subspecies. All show features of convergent evolution with canids, including non-retractile claws, long muzzles, and adaptations to running for long distances. They are extant in the Middle East, India and Africa. Hyenas are large, powerful animals, up to 80 kg and represent one of the most prolific large carnivorans on the planet. The aardwolf is much smaller at 27 kg and is a specialized feeder, eating mainly harvester termites. Family Herpestidae has 32 species. Previously, these were placed in the Viveridae family. However, Wilson and Reda established the Herpestids as morphologically and genetically distinct from Viverids. They are extant in Africa, Middle East and Asia. All have non-retractile claws. They are smaller as a family, ranging from 1 kg to 5 kg, and typically have long, slender bodies and short legs. Diet varies based on species size and available food sources, ranging from small mammals, birds to reptiles, insects and crabs. Some species are omnivorous, including fruits and tubers in their diet. Family Nandiniidae has only one species, extant across sub-Saharan Africa. They have retractile claws and are slender-bodied, arboreal omnivores. They are relatively small with the larger males weighing up to 5 kg. Family Ponodontidae has two extant species in one genus. They live in southern East Asia. All are arboreal hypercarnivorans. They are the closest living relatives of the family Felidae. Family Viveridae has 30 extant species and all have retractile claws. They are extant in southern Europe, Africa and Asia. They range in size from 500 g up to medium-sized carnivorans at 14 kg. They have long bodies and short legs and usually have long tails. Diet ranges from small mammals and insects through to crustaceans and mollusks. Evolution In the middle Paleocene, Miyakoidae appears. Myakoids were a group of paraphyletic taxa believed to be basal to carnivora. They had carnivora-like carnitials but lacked fully ossified auditory bully. Mesids were small arboreal carnivorans and, based on their size, they probably fed on insects, small mammals and birds. The myakoids are divided into two groups, the mesids, with a full complement of molars, and the vivora beans with a reduced number of molars and more specialized carnitials. These dental differences resemble the difference between caniforms and foliforms but this may not mean evolutionary lineages. It was thought that Viveravidae was basal to the foliforms. However, recent studies suggest this is not the case. 5. In the Middle Eocene the Mesids started to branch into two distinct groups of the order Carnivora, the foliforms and caniforms. The Mesid precursors to the extant foliforms remained forest-dwelling, arboreal or semi-arboreal ambush hunters, while the caniform precursors were more mobile, opportunistic hunters. While it is clear the first filiforms appeared at this time, there is no clear common ancestor of the filiform families in the fossil records. As forest dwellers, the early filiforms were subject to more rapid decomposition in the absence of sedimentary materials, resulting in large gaps in the fossil records. For more discussion on filiform evolution and the divergence from the caniforms, together with additional external references on this subject, see the articles on Carnivora, Miyakoidae and Carnivora Morpha. The diagram below presents a contemporary view of filiform evolution and familial relationships overlaid onto the geological time scale. The information presented is based on fossil records and systematic classifications. Phylogenetic tree, references. Taxonomic references extant species. 
supporting descriptive information and pictures, diversity web, Feliformia. Taxonomic references extant species, ITIS Integrated Taxonomic Information System, Fossil Record Data Extant and Extinct Species, the Palea Biology Database, Supporting Taxonomic References Extant and Extinct Species, Sistema Naturae 2000 Slash Classification, Suborder Feliformia, Gina D. Wesley Hunt and John J. Flynn 2005, Phylogeny of the Carnivora, Andy Yoda and John J. Flynn 2003, Origin of Malagasy Carnivora, Yoda, A. M. Burns, S. Sear, T. Della Foss, G. Barron, S. Goodman, J. Flynn. 2003, Single Origin of Malagasy Carnivora from an African Ancestor A Euro Letters to Nature, Philippe Gorbert, W. Chris Wozencraft, Pedro Cordero Estlan and Gar Copyright Royal Dean Barron. 2005, Mosaics of Convergences and Noise in Morphological Phylogenies. What's in a vivarid like carnivoran? Isaac E. W. J. Murphy, K. P. Coepfly, W. E. Johnson, J. W. Dragu, R. K. Wayne, N. S. J. O'Brien, 2010. Pattern and timing of the diversification of the mammalian order carnivora inferred from multiple nuclear gene sequences. Molecular phylogenetics and evolution 56, 49 Euro 63 doi. 10.1016 slash jimpov 2010.01.033